Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a lovely day. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. It really helps me out a lot. Okay guys, so let's get into this video. So today, as you can tell from the title, I have a kit review. And I have a kit here, as you can see. Uh, she is a real born, as you can see from the uh, birth certificate. She is the real born Alexa Asleep. Yeah, so I'm going to be reviewing her. I think she's a really cute kit, and I just wanted to share her with you guys and let you guys know my opinion. So let's just get her out of the bag. So we'll start with her head. So first, she has this really adorable little face. So, so cute. I really love the ears on this kit. Um, she is really cute. The ears look really realistic to me. If you... Yeah, okay, you guys can see. So... Yeah, she is a really cute kid. I really like her. I do recommend her. She has really chubby legs. So if you're thinking about getting this baby, but you're not sure if you'll like her or not because you haven't seen a lot of her, I'm going to show you piece by piece. So here she is. She has really chubby legs. Really, really chubby. She has a good sized foot. I think she could really wear newborn size shoes and maybe preemie size. Not sure, but her foot is about the size of my finger. As you can see, it's a little bit bigger. So yeah, she has some chubby legs, good sized feet for shoes and all. But yeah, I think this kit could definitely wear some newborn shoes. And um, this baby will either be for sale or I may keep her when completed. Not sure yet. May keep her. Not sure though. But we'll see. But yeah, here's the other leg. Super, super chubby kit. I love it. Okay, now let's get to her arms. This video is going to be short, guys. I do apologize that I haven't uploaded in a while. A lot of you guys are wondering where Elijah went, which was my real-born Joseph. He is with his new mommy. Um, bills come up, and I had to sell him, sadly. It's like, I feel like I can't keep a baby in my collection for the life of me. But I do enjoy being an artist and making these beautiful babies. Um, but, yeah, I do plan to get some babies in my collection soon. So yeah, stick around for that, and yeah, I'll have more videos here soon, but anyway, so we have one closed hand with its little pinky up, I think that is so cute, guys, and this kit has so many fat rolls, guys, as you can see, and uh, I just love it. I recommend this kit 100%, and then here's a sort of opened kit, we got two fingers up, and the details, guys, on this is just amazing i really love real born kits i'm not much for regular bountiful baby kits um some of them are cute they can be painted completely beautiful it's just i don't i'm not much for the feel of their kit like if you feel a real born kit if you're an artist or have collected kits or something you know this you can feel the difference in a real born kit compared to let's say a mcpherson mcpherson's kit kit and a regular bountiful baby kit you can feel the difference and yeah, I just prefer, if it's a bountiful baby kit, I prefer a real born. I do make others. I have made plenty of um, regular kits, and I've owned regular kits. But my preference is real born or more expensive, like MacPherson's Crafts kits. Just the feelings of the kit is just amazing. It's wow. You can definitely tell a difference. So, I do have the body, but I'm not going to put this little gal together. But just an idea... Um, I think this baby is 19 inches long, 19, 20 inches long when completed. Just show you another view of her face. She does have the um, soft spot, which most realborns do, I'm pretty sure. But yeah, she has kind of the uh, line of the head. It's very, very faint. You know, it's not as noticeable as like twin A and Bs or anything, but um, still really cute. I really like this kit. Leave a like if you like it. Leave a like on the video if you guys like this kit. Sorry, guys. I haven't made a video in so long. I'm a little rusty. I do apologize, but bear with me. But, yeah, I just wanted to hop on and show you guys this baby that I will be working on. Comment down below and let me know if you'd like to see some progress on this baby as I paint. And, yeah, I have a couple babies on my table. I'm working on a sunny kit, you know, the smiling awake baby. Um, it's a custom I'm doing for a friend, 
and oh it's gorgeous guys i will show you guys that baby when it's completed hopefully if uh everything goes right i will make a video showing you guys that baby when it's completed and i'm also working on another custom which i'm gonna do a kit review on that real soon because oh, i absolutely love that kit it's so cute but anyways guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video sorry it's so short sorry i haven't been around a lot but um yeah i'm gonna have some babies in my collection soon you know, I just got to make them, buy them, you know, all the So, yeah, I will have videos up soon, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I hope it wasn't that bad because I am really rusty. So, again, here's the COA. Really cute. I do recommend this kit if you're thinking about a new custom, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.